Hello everyone and welcome back to Rainbow Reads by Roxy. Today we have a very interesting book. In between the read, please feel free to pause and have a look at the pictures. Today's book is called Wacky Wednesday. Wacky Wednesday. Wacky Wednesday by Dr. Seuss. Illustrated by George Booth. It all began with that shoe on the wall. A shoe on the wall? Shouldn't be there at all. Then I looked up and I said, oh man. And that's how Wacky Wednesday began. I looked out the window and I said, gee, more things were wacky and I saw three. I went down the hall and I said, hey, three more things were wacky today. In the bathroom, more. In the bathroom, four. I began to dress. Then I said, wow, four more things were wacky now? I looked in the kitchen, I said, by cracky, five more things are very wacky. I was late for school, I started along, and I saw that six more things were wrong. And then seven more. And the Sutherland sisters, they looked wacky too. They said, nothing is wacky around here but you. But look! I yelled. Eight things are wrong here at school. Nothing is wrong, they said. Don't be a fool. I ran into school. I yelled to Miss Bass. Look, nine things are wacky right here in your class. Nothing is wacky here in my class. Get out! You're the wacky one out! Said Miss Bass. I went out the school door. Things were worse than before. I couldn't believe it. Ten wacky things more. Then I counted eleven. Then twelve worse things. I got scared and I ran. I ran and knocked over Patrolman again. I'm sorry, Patrolman. That's all I could say. Don't be sorry, he smiled. It's that kind of day. But be glad Wacky Wednesday will soon go away. Only 20 things more will be wacky, he said. Just find them 
and then you can go back to bed. Wacky Wednesday was gone when I counted them all and I even got rid of that shoe on the wall. The end. I do hope you enjoyed today's book and I do hope you found everything that made Wacky Wednesday wacky. Until our next read, take care. Bye-bye.